What is up everyone and welcome back to another guide about Fantasy Star Online 2. Today we're going to be talking about the cheapest grinding method and what you can do with trash items. First we're going to be talking about trash items since it's quite straightforward. From 1 to 6, feed it to a mag for energy or don't pick it up. Some of these aren't worth it unless they have good augments on them. From 7 to 9, save them for desynthesis if you want to but it's not really needed. From 10 stars to 11 stars, exchange these for X cubes. 15 star weapons exchanged via Zeke in future episodes will require 400 X cubes, so prioritize this. You can also trade 10 to 11 star units for photon spheres via the swap shop at a 5 to 1 ratio. Next up is 12 stars. Sell them on the market, then buy other 12 star gear that's the same type of gear you use to grind it into your current gear. This is because you get bonus XP if the weapon you're grinding is the same type. If you have an abundance of 12 stars, then feel free to directly grind it into your weapon. This is more expensive than selling it on the market and buying it, but it takes less time. Keep in mind you do need grinders as well as Masetta every time you grind a weapon. So you do need to do a cost analysis to actually see which one is cheaper. And luckily for you guys, I actually did it. When feeding 12 stars into 12 stars, the same type of item at plus zero gives 200 XP. Any other type of item at plus zero gives 140 XP. On top of that, each plus one grinded gives 40 XP. So plus one gives 40, plus two is 80, plus three is 120, plus four is 160, and plus 5 is 200. On top of that, it costs 35,000 Masetta each time you grind. So if you grind 5 12 star items into another 12 star item, that will cost you in fees 175,000 Masetta. If you were to grind 5 different type items into one other item, that will give you 700 XP at the cost of the item price times 5 plus 175,000. For the fees. If you were to grind 5 of the same type item, you will gain 1000 XP at the cost of the item price times 5 plus 175,000, meaning grinding the same weapon over different item gives you plus 43% EXP. So to simplify it, if the item price of the same type item is 43% less than a different type of item, it is worth it to buy the same type item. So the different type item times 1.43 is the maximum price you should pay for the same type item. So if the same type item is higher than that max price, do not buy it. If it's lower, then buy it. Now that's the simplified version, but we're going to go deeper into it so you can maximize your cost analysis. Now there's a lot before this, but I cut that out of the video in order to save you guys some confusion. We need to compare the cost of the same XP gain. So since 5 different types gives you 700 and 5 same types gives you 1000 XP, then the common number we're going to be using is 1400 XP. In order to get 1400 XP, you need 10 different type items or 7 of the same type items. So let's use that as a calculation. So 10 different type items plus 10 times the fees equals 7 of the same type item plus seven times the fees. So after you do that calculation, that gives you the price of when a different type item equals the same type item. So what does this mean? If you sell a different type item for the amount listed on the left, say 10,000 or 11,000 and so on, that will equal the price of the same type item on the right. So for example, if you sell a different type item for 10,000 net after taxes, then you buy a same type of item for 29,285, then you break even. If that same type of item is less than 29,285, then you'll be getting more EXP. After all this, it gets more complicated. We gotta go back to the beginning. Different type of item gives you 140 EXP, and the same type of item gives you 200 EXP. But well, you're gonna ask yourself, what if it rolled as a grinded plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four, or plus five? Each plus one grinded on a weapon gives you 40 more EXP. So a different type item at plus one will give you 180, 
at plus 2, it will give you 220 EXP. Thus, at plus 2, different type item will be better than getting a same type of item at plus 0. When you're going through the player marker, you might see plus 1, plus 2, plus 3, plus 4, or plus 5 same type versions and you might ask yourself should I buy this over a clean 12 star same type version well here is the answer for same type weapon at plus one it gives you 20 percent more exp per grinded so at plus one it gives you 20 percent plus two is 40 plus three is 60 plus four is 80 and plus five gives you double exp meaning buy it if the cost is 19 percent or less than a plus zero same type weapon. If it's plus two, that's 39% or less. A plus three, 59% or less. Plus four is 79% or less. And plus five is 99% or less. The formula changes dramatically when you introduce granite gear. So to simplify it, just sell 12 star different gear unless it's plus two or above. In that case, grind it into your gear. Then buy the same type of gear and if it's grinded, add 20% cost per grind to see if it's worth it. Yes, I know that it's not a 100% calculated cost with grinded, but it's a simplified version. So to recap, different type of item sold at X equals the same type of item bought at Y. So if you sell a different type of item at 10,000, the maximum you should pay for a same type of item is 29,285 meseta. And that goes down the list. Grind different type items plus two or above into your gear, then sell the plus one or plus zero at the market. If you want to know if you should buy a grinded type version or not, buy it if it's 20% less than a plus zero same type item per grind level. And that's it. I know the last part isn't 100% calculated, but it's a simplified version. And I don't want to pull out Excel and do business statistics again because I hate it. If you have any questions or want a video made about a certain topic, please comment that down below. If you liked this video and it helped you, please hit that like button and subscribe for more videos. And on that note, thank you for listening and tuning in. And until next time.